everyone. I have another tree to show y'all. Um, it's not a real tree, but it is a ceramic tree that my mom uh, made. And um, I guess you can see it's about two, it's about two feet tall. Uh, it means a lot to me. I have moved this everywhere. Um, I have had moved. I brought it with me. Um, she, um, this was, she had, you know, she painted the snow on it. These bulbs, all, every single bulb on here, she did. I just recently found a star to fit it, but it, I've got to figure out some way to make, you know, so the light can shine up. I don't know. But anyway, I was just so excited. I finally found a star to top it. And I want to show you a couple of things. Um, back in the late 70s, my mom, um, I forgot what she called this acrylic paints. Um, I can't find the one that she did, but I did this. I was like seven or eight years old, eight, maybe eight or ten years old. And we both did these when I, we were living in Arizona. And I found this little Santa. Um, she also painted when she was taking ceramic classes. Um, she did this in 1980 because I saw that she wrote it on the bottom. I would have never even known what, um, what year she did it, but, um, Yep, she wrote Pat, and she wrote eight, 1980 on it. Um, and I just, this little Santa has uh, been so special to me, and I'm so glad I still have it. And then there's my little tree, and I, I wish one of these days I'm going to get the music box to fix. Um, the base, um, this little base here, it's got holly on it, uh, is a, as actually a music box. And... Um, but it doesn't play anymore, <laughs> and uh, hopefully one day I'll be able to get it fixed. But uh, I just thought I would share with you real quick my mom's ceramic tree that she made and hand-painted and decorated herself. All righty, well, I hope everyone is having a uh, very Merry Christmas, and I hope everyone has a blessed day.